Tapping out from screen. None landing just yet, though. Oh, that's a rarity. They've gotten away with a full mag out of the sheriff, a full chamber, so to speak. He's going for a few more. Enemy but those shots land on the other side eventually. Italy dealing with Scream. And the pistols, well, oh, they're not finding a ton of success. You've at least got that pick for Beastie. It's opened up a bit of space on A. Nevera's crept his way in. Shot that. Of course, remove the Italian side's utility. So, like, they're having to fill in through halls, keep that control now. That trap that's up isn't online. Cause a lot of uncertainty. Leaves Lomba just isolated on this side. Nevera's being a little sneaky. He may not have his chamber, but there's a good opportunity. He's going to get the shot with the sheriff instead. Beepo also being spotted out in the back lines. They are actually going to be getting that spike plant in. I don't think there's too much they can do to deny that. Oh, okay. Well, Nevera's gone down. Quick and easy. Bippo's on the way through. Going for the no scopes and hitting them all. Four kills already. And the final player just 24 HP. The ghost coming out to finish it in a beautiful snap to the head. An ace out of this man. A lot of hype over on the desk. And, well, you can see why. It's basically the opposite of how we expected that to go. He's gone hunting for that one. Rotation has come out now. We can see the move on the other side from Harbour getting into the site. And while these trades are just not coming through, finally, Nivira will put one in the deck. But already a fantastic hold. Rage at the back will leave it down to just Kira. A one versus four, Spike not in a control and no chance. A brilliant shutdown. Now they've used the high tide to get themselves in towards the Spike and after plant. Again, looking likely, although the shock darts have done their work. The question is how can the Belgium squad try and do anything in this after plant scenario? And with again, people already pushing in from behind. He's looking to take this battle, but Scream wins it out. Yeah, nice return by the rifle that's in play, but they're walled off. Hunter's Fury used here. It's going to find the kill, but they've already got it halfway. A second kill out One of it. This might even the numbers enough. Idex is already wrapping around and Scream finishes it with a triple. What a ridiculous round from Ben Lux. We got a push coming out here towards the B site. Lunaris did so much damage in the previous round, spamming on through that smoke. This time, just tucked in on the back while fight goes down on middle, but eventually she's completely surrounded. Nevera just keeps it going as well. Running it through to their spawn, clearing the wall, and now a wide swing out catches the Alpha Sparker. Lomba almost followed and will. The scream gets the revenge. A third round is found. I think they're, they're just having some fun, no, and if it gets dangerous, and I think again that's going to be the reckoning online. Even though I, I don't know if it's necessarily the strongest ult in the form of taking the site, I, I just think the information that you get off it is so worthwhile. Nice kill by Beastie as well. This is locking it down. Four versus three, four versus two. All the control, all the post plant utility to work with. Only the Vipers down right now, which would have been a pit online, but it doesn't seem to be needed. Bippo has to have another phenomenal performance, and he dashes right onto a shock dart, but Lunaris able to trade it back. Damage for kills as we end up equal. Two versus two. A tour de force still lurking around, but the shots aren't landing. The cloud burst Player across. Standing. Bippo's got the kill and almost found Beastie. The shot's whizzing past his head. Awesome. They've got to get on this defuse. The time's got to be low. Beastie just needs to deny this. He's gotten through and indeed escaped. <laughs> A gorgeous attempt by Italy. <laughs> Ben looks find it in the end, and Beastie looks cool as he closes it out. A decent dart as well, but... Oh! oh, God. I don't know how Scream gets that kill. You've just got to feel frustrated. And it's actually pulled a pretty big rotation, but for the attacking side, they are not necessarily going in this direction just yet. I believe Spark is still trying to watch from a distance, but after being spotted in mid, well... I say spotted, they definitely have been now, and Scream's still looking to try and take every fight and eventually gets the job done. One tap, nice and easy. Another one tap, this one's Nevera. Oh, another one tap, look at that, gorgeous. Cleaning it up over on the Beneluxian inside. Only got that was well, one tap. the big old gun to deal with, that it was. It's got the golden gun, Sparker, one versus two. Low HP on both. He spotted the leg. Oh, but the shot's not hit. The second is the golden gun matched by the Guardian. Nevera will close out this round. Beastie actually taking this one. Glass cannon hits a collapse. 
Spark is going to take him down and Scream alongside him. Looking like an even half, looking likely, although we've already seen some hefty damage put out by this ult before. This time, no, not so much. Yeah, it gets a little bit of damage in, but certainly not what Benelux need to recover on this disadvantage. Sparker ready for that push. Looked away for a second, but that didn't deter him from hitting the shot. Oh, no. Nevera able to find one a second now. They've really got to take him down. That was an ambitious attempt with a shorty, but it doesn't matter in the end. A gorgeous retake in. And they have found themselves a six to six half. Got to wait for it to be burned up. But Drone here, it's going to catch Idex. So even though he's caught a kill, he had to bail quickly. Luckily, though, he's gotten away for free. Trades come in slowly. Shock darts on the way. Bippo down to 59 from them. And Idex will find another. This is a bit of a disaster. A headshot just connected. That leaves your uh, Italian chamber on just one HP. Sparker, 13, as you can see, one shot. All that's needed. And there's a whole battalion of Beneluxian players waiting for him. Just no chance here, really. Lomba oh. getting the double, but the defuse right under his nose. Early space. Kira's also pushed all the way through, and so has Scream. A first for free. Has a decent idea that there's still somebody around the angle. Of course, you haven't taken out the Viper, and the wall's gone down. So you can have a pretty decent guess that there's going to be a second player. Yeah, stun didn't exactly hit where he wanted, but. He still makes it out for free. Resets and Beasties here. Spike the down operator in hand from earlier on. Remaining. And they are feeding him. Walking into the shooting gallery. Dropping the spike for him. Rage has to do it all. He's on his way Dude, back. Spike. Avoiding the blind fire. Of right. Beastie. <laughs> he wants to pursue him. He's jumped through the wall. He's made it into cave. Rage knows that he's hearing these steps. He's waiting for them. But Beastie still hits the shot. And you can see he's fired up about it. Nine to six. Big fan of this play. Uh, the wall up. They've even got the jet dashing out, putting the cloud burst down. Safe spot to start the ultimate Spike from. And, well, it's well, got to say, it's one of the more frustrating things. You're, right, you're getting killed from a, a spot that's actually trapped up. You know, covering an angle that utility is covering. Now, granted, you want a bit more control. Maybe you want to throw out a late round flank, but that is such a valuable kill for Benelux, putting the numbers even slightly back into their favor. That drone has come from way too far back. It was from the spawn, so it only reaches the ult. It doesn't come near clearing it, and that means they've got to do that dry. Gotta just run in and take it. the fights! What is that from Bippo? Absolutely not allowed. Scream has picked up one. He's picked up two, but there's not much more that he can do. He is out of here to save this weapon, and they are going to meet him in middle. Oh. Maybe he's going to meet them. He's just speeding away. He's come back into the angle for more. That's absolutely disgusting. Oh, he doesn't win them the round, but he does make it costly, and I, I don't think that's going to be too bad. He's willing to swing into this. The wave has come and then, well, washed away any chances for him to pick someone up until they come through it. And the plant now coming down. Here's the swing. There's the kill. Beastie confident to stay aggressive. He's got him. What? Styling all over them. This spike is down. And they're going to be able to defuse now. Hunter's Fury thrown out. It hasn't even hit on the first pulse. They've gotten it halfway. And they can stick it now further down. The spray from Sparker not even close. And that round is going to haunt Team Italy for months to come. I, I can't believe it. One and free. Maybe two and free. But oh, what? He's already got two. Oh, oh, what the hell is going on? Screams on the ace. This round lasted less time than the by face. <laughs> what? I think they, what, they used the reckoning straight into the spawn? Is, is that what happened there? Because it seemed... Oh, no. That was just his own stuns. No, there you go. Okay, they did use it. But they were already all stunned up by Scream himself. There's no assists on any of these kills. Except the last one. We came back into the game, and it was his second swing of the round. <laughs> He'd already swung, killed, and oh, gotten back oh, in no. a fraction of a millisecond. No! No! Don't do it to him! <laughs> that is just disrespectful. You're the worst thing as well. That's the Tour de Force God. That was their main oh, weapon. Oh, man. Luckily, they've got rid of Beastie. However, Idex... Now evens things up once again. An advantage going into the second map, looking very likely. Lomba being caught on the timing as well. Oh, Pippo, he's still doing damage. He's still a force to be reckoned with. He's got Navira to deal with on this side of the map, though. He spotted him. 
trying to use his own utility no against him, and that's what Navira does. The swing remains. for another, and just closes out the game Defenders with a triple. Win. Benelux finish things in style. Their defensive side nigh on flawless. We'll see if they can make this one work. They, they've used the cove as well to try and give them that little bit of extra space. Five you know what? Nivera has been able to get out of there through the TP. Space taken by Vipper, but Heidegg still wins the duel. Even after getting the drop in him, he can't quite hit the shots. And while well, now all Benelux need to do is trade, but that's looking a little bit more difficult than you might think. Yeah, it certainly is. Uh, a, a clean start, maybe not a clean close. Only the body shots needed from Beastie, but he's only good for one. Lomba's escaped, 65 HP, and a molly to work with. It's going to be fired out pretty early, I hope. But Lomba's singing away there in the background, or we could be in trouble. And I think I can see it. Some sweet lullabies being played through as we did. A molly kill. Beastie stuck it. The molly rained down. It caught him. This could be dangerous time now a bit of a factor 65 hp lomba dodging the bullets running the no. clock down defuse underway drop is good and lomba's won it some things you just can't <laughs> certainly a strong start to the attacking Ooh, side for italy dimensional drift now it's going to allow for a lot of information to be found some space to be taken but they are losing Five players left and right there standing. needs to be a lot coming up from people here and he gets nothing for for scream he has an instant dismiss. The downside is you have to get a kill, but for screen, that's not a downside. He gets the kill time and time again. Right here, though, Italy are the ones to strike first. Oh, and that's dangerous. They've almost caught a player sneaking up towards the garden. And this is an immediate push. They want to hunt down that player that was close. Hunt down Bippo, who's in the open and dealt with. Scream stepping it up to at least do some damage, and with two kills, this round is actually back under control. Nevera is even stepping into the smoke, but Sparkers caught him. What? How can Scream? It feels like he's playing on three different monitors at once. <laughs> like he's aiming at two different angles, perfect crosshair placement, can swap between them no problem. I, I don't get it. You just saw that one tap attempt with a dismiss after, and right there, just a few bullets. Obviously, Tour de Force helps out a ton. Now Scream leading the charge again, looking for this B aggression. And, and look, he at okay, least gets you know. one. That's a bad round for Scream. Yeah, no, the trade's coming through. It's aggression off aggression off aggression, but can Navira find the timing? No. They're already going to be around the corner. It's up to Beastie this time to try and hold on to this. Reckoning versus an operator's not going to be great. The TV setup is sublime. Leaving him stunned, revealed, and oh, Beepo's going to be able to find the space. They have not cleared out Navira, though. That's always a dangerous prospect. Nightfall through is going to leave them all vulnerable without sound and a chance for him to maybe steal this one away. He's going to reveal at least where a couple of the players already should have done. It seems like it missed. Just went off into the distance. Yeah, the Prowler didn't lock on for whatever reason, and that's going to suck. Uh, just a moving recon dart. Now looking to fight his way back out of Lamps, and they have done a fantastic job here. All that space seized on the Italian side of four versus two. Scream still lurking around, though. A problem, as always. He's got three kills, and the defuse is being tapped, pulling them into the open, but Sparker is only gone and taken down. Scream, they're going to get in there. What? Nobody went near the spike. Did, did, where did, no, where did... Italy, three rounds on the board. That could have been four. It should have been four. And now they're being decimated again in these Spike duels. Down. A good answer back by Lomba and Sparker, but Nevera's here, and he is not letting them have an inch. Defending that site with his life. The spike is stuck on long, and off picked up by Lomba, and maybe it'll give a little bit of hope, but Nevera instantly shuts that down. Fake TP up close. They've seen that. Those screams primed and ready. Idex, he's baiting for them. If they even check for Scream to be here. Oh, the bubbles caused a bit of a problem, but not that much. Still good for one, the dismiss, and he wants to go around it. The flash is in, the seize is in, and so are the kills. Spike on the floor. This final round for Italy seems to be a requisite, but, well, it is now far away from a possibility. What? Shut down by Idex, the reckoning for the stun, and Beastie, don't you dare, don't you dare. A nice try, and if he was hit by the ult, who knows? But Scream's the one to close this out with nine on the board for Benelux. Victory seems to be within their grasp. Oh, they're going into elbow. They've used the wall to just curve it around, move their way into their spawn. Is this an A hit? No way. They go through spawn, right? They're go yeah, they're going all the way. It's an A hit. 
This is like a round the world strat. Are they, 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 this isn't this isn't a milestone. It's just them just like playing strat roulette or something for their pistol round because even though they're get, getting caught along the way, they're losing casualties. They've still come out with a player advantage. It's actually insane. And there's the peak from screen, but he doesn't win the fight. Oh, no. Okay. 10 HP in a dream. He's hit two headshots, and that keeps them alive. Kira's going to get this done. Both players are low. Body shots needed, but Bippo comes up behind after using his TP, I think. That is just insane. They're going to force. Oh, right. that is not how you want this round to start. If you're an Italian fan, immediately with the Marshall headshot, we've got a rifle picked up for Benelux. Bippo's in the TP. He's opened the doors. They know where he is. He's able to fall back, though, and he goes right back to the A site. The problem is on B, the trades are coming in, and they are favoring Benelux. Now they've even got a spike plan. So close to going in their direction. But now into that two versus four scenario. A low player or two, but well, I think Scream just wow. hit a no scope headshot onto Beepo as he went running through. Has an op still covering him on the push up. I mean, they're a ah, death trap here in theory, but they're the ones stealing death. Yeah, timing couldn't have been much worse. And Navira just decimates the defense. Lumba. The only player left anywhere near the action is the remainder look to try and rotate no Nevera. And Nevera's going to go hunting. You, know, you wouldn't be surprised, although down to 66 HP, especially with the spike, has to be a little bit careful not to overheat. And they're just going to play into that after plant instead. And we're also seeing the Reckoning come out from the defense on the retake. Oh, interesting. They used their ult over towards triple and bath. Kira, well, still tucked in, safe as can be, able to catch Rage off. An angle left open. Nevera falling on a triple. Uh, the kills is what it comes down to. These duels that are being fought by Benelux are going their way. Nevera's had a hell of a round. Oh, oh, follows through on the damage done earlier. Orbital strike online and a vague sky. idea of where Beastie might be. It's a good ult, and that's going to at least get it halfway. Beastie's got to sprint back in. They can't risk another ninja defuse, and Beastie wins it. He's actually caught the shot, jumping up, almost running. As they steam through to 11-5. A lot of star players in this game right now. Beepo's been one of them. He's been looking unbelievable. He's on the A site, though. And with Sparker down and not having the same flair as he has versus some of the other teams, we might be looking at the last round being around the world. They're fighting into the spawn, the duels. Well, they seem to be favoring they Benelux. Be it's a close fight so far. The slow is bypassed by Scream, but the ult it's catching Rage. They're pursuing <laughs> him all the way down. Yeah, it's good standing. damage, but he couldn't quite get what I he needed. This. And Beepo started yeah. inside a bathroom. Now he's on B long, and they're going A. That's the thing. They know they cleared out the entirety of the B site. It's, it, it's the stubbornness of this strat will work once. We will win a round by running through their spawn. <laughs> and you know what? This is probably the one. Spike a three planted. versus one. Beepo has his ult, which might be able to give him the information, but he has to win this battle versus Scream. If he gets that, maybe there's a chance, and the timing almost worked out for him. Scream almost seems to be playing with his food at this point, trying to bait him into you this angle, play, stuck between play. the two of them. <laughs> it's just oh, playing oh, with him, oh, just oh, messing oh, with him. And while the dimensional drift... Okay, well, this has become a little bit trolly. Not the most exciting end to the game as Beepo's time is ticking. <laughs> He's got to try and find one of these players. None of them is looking for it. No! Oh, going for the knife! It's almost there from Kira. 25 HP. Scream's going to do it. He has to try and stick it this time. It. And oh, it's just mean. Scream has decided to ruin Beepo's day and eliminate the Italians with a knife.